Here we have a Fossil wallet came in this case. It says Fossil, really nice carrying case. Let's say in the back here. Yeah, Fossil, interesting, really nice. Let's open it up and take a look at this wonderful wallet. That is a really hefty case, wow. So this wallet comes in this really, really nice case. It's like a metal case. I like it a lot. Look at that, Fossil, oh yeah. This is nice, genuine leather bifold with flip ID. I can smell the leather from here. I'm gonna give it a whiff. Oh yeah, this is really nice. I love the faded look. Let's take a closer look at this awesome wallet. I am still totally blown away by the case. It's really nice. I did not expect this wallet to come in such a nice case. It's all smooth and velvety. By the way, the color of this one is black. So even though it might not look black, that is the color that you are seeing. I think the fading uh, might make you think it's brown, but the official color of this wallet is black. There's the fossil emblem. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Oh, that is nice. Look at the packaging, really nice little, yeah, nice little paper, oh, so nice. Yeah, super, super nice wallet. What an interesting wallet design. So here's where your ID goes, where it says fossil, right? You just open it up, it folds open like this. And then here you can put some stuff. There's some room in there, nice black velvety material. You can put your cards in here. So you've got one, two, three, four spots for your cards. Here you can put your Benjamin Franklin's or George Washington's or any other type of denomination that you want to store in here. Really, and really nice. This is nice. where it gets really interesting. Watch this, if you open this up, it opens up even more, so you have even more storage. So you could put your ID here if you want to. So you have two choices, right? You can you can put it here, or you can put it here. It's really up to you because see this this paper here. Let me pull it out. This comes out, and so you could put an ID there or there. So you have a, a choice on where to put it. So interesting decision to have to make. Plenty of storage for cards in this wallet. Again, one, two, three, four here. Then you have four here, you have this pocket down here, and then you have this pocket down here as well. And then you have another pocket down here, and then you have this dual purpose, we can use your ID here or here. I think there's another, no, there's no other pocket there. That'd be ridiculous. So plenty of storage, Just look inside it. And yeah, that's where you put your Benjamins. And then, yeah, I, I like the option to have the ID in two spots again here or you can open it up completely and put it there. Really good quality, I love the faded look. I'm gonna give it another whiff, because this is leather. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's definitely leather. A lot of times you buy wallets and they say they're leather, and you can get a leather smell, but like it's not like a super great smell. This is a really nice leather smell. This little book was inside um, the wallet. Let's see what it says, let's take a look at it. This product will naturally carry some texture and color variations in the leather that make it unique. How interesting. Yeah, it's really, it's, it's, it's very, I wonder if that means that if you buy a wallet like this on Amazon, yours might look a little bit different, right? Because it says these are color variations in the leather that make it unique. So maybe they all look a little bit different, right? You see they're fading there. Really quite nice. Keep your leather product looking great. Maintain the appearance of your fossil leather product by avoiding contact with water, oil, makeup, and items that contain permanent dyes as damage or color transfer can occur. Limit exposure to sunlight, heat, humidity, and chemical cleaners. Wow, they're not messing around, right? This is a real leather wallet. So they're telling you how to take care of your precious leather. Before cleaning your leather product with a damp cloth, first test on an, on an inconspicuous area to ensure satisfactory results. It looks like here it just says the same thing in different languages. Wow, look at all those cool languages. I mean, so many. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah, I think it's just the same thing in multiple languages. So, you know, that, that's pretty cool. I always think it's really cool when you buy something and it comes in like a bunch of, you know, different languages. It's like, you know, they sell these wallets, I guess, I mean, all over the world, or maybe people who read different languages will buy them and so they can read the instructions. Really nice, nice little booklet. It also says fossil on the book. I like that a lot. I like this wallet a lot, like a lot, a lot, because it's leather and it actually smells really good. Let me just, yeah, it has a really good leather smell. I like the fading. I like that it comes with this cool little case. This piece comes out, by the way, I left it in, but you can put it back in your case just like this. 
close it up and you can keep it in your case. And you know, when you buy a wallet like this, what's gonna happen is you're going to transfer all of the items from your current wallet to your new wallet. And what that's gonna do is that's going to force you to organize your wallet. Look at the faded look while I talk, but yeah. So currently my current wallet is super, super, super thick. It's like that thick, right? Cause it's full of like old receipts from things I bought years ago that I don't even remember buying, um, old expired library cards, um, just, you know, old movie theater tickets, just random stuff, random business cards that I've picked up for random things that I no longer need. But I somehow feel the need to hold on to those like weird business cards. Well, when you get a new wallet, it forces you to transfer everything over to your new wallet. And it forces you to make decisions about like what to keep and what not to keep. And so you can slim down your life. You can really organize your life by getting a new wallet. This is pretty thin, by the way. Shockingly thin. I mean, look at that. That's super thin. So if you get a new wallet, my advice would be to you know slim things down and keep what you need. Look at this stitching here. I just noticed this. That's really nice. It's like, let me see if it's on the other side there. Oh yeah, that's really elegant. Really nice, really well made, genuine leather wallet. Overall, I think this is a fantastic wallet. If you are looking for a new wallet, I, I don't think you can go wrong with something like this. I love that it's leather. I love the option to put your ID in either spot. You can put it there or uh, you can open it up and put it there. So you have two choices on where to put it. Um, I like that it has plenty of space for cards and it's got enough space for cards where you should be able to put, you know, each card in an individual slot. Like my current wallet, I think only has like three spaces. And so what I end up doing is stacking a gazillion cards and I can never find them. With a wallet like this, you can put one card in each in each pocket and you'll be able to open it and actually find your cards. And it'll also help you again, you know, organize your wallet life. It'll help you slim down. This is a great wallet for anyone looking for a new wallet. Uh, this comes in different colors, I believe. Again, this color you see here is black. So that is the color of this wallet. Even though it doesn't really look black, that is the color that uh, I purchased. So I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.